getting into the swing of things, Kamde knows what it takes to compete at the highest level. He is a product of the NEL's foundation and turned professional in 2004. He started giving golfing clinics in 2015. Um, to look back where I, 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 I come from and I've seen how many kids out there that are so good but um, because of lack of opportunities especially in Africa so I thought that being an African and being have played here and, and growing out of here and going overseas and achieve uh, some of the things that I have achieved I believe there's a better James Gumpty out there but the only problem is that the talent is not is not uh, is not is not uh, uncovered here. Firstly, a lot of us have been following James Kamte and his career, which has been very successful over the years, and we're very proud that amongst our own can come somebody that was not only inspiring but to reach the highest levels. And usually, when people as pro golfers have got that kind of um, uh, success behind them, they hardly remember to go back to where they come from and then plow back and do good in society. So I particularly am very proud of what James has decided to do. These young golfers are all aiming high. My father is playing golf. He said I must go out in the street and play with him golf. I love golf, but it's a sport I can play, but not other sports is golf. In soccer, I can play, but golf is good for me. It all started with my father, who has a, who loved golf, and uh, at a young age he taught us as well. And along the way, I actually uh, started loving golf more. Kamde's sights are now on next year's European tour, but he will first tee up at the South African Open at Ren Park Golf Club early January. Zolani Moya, SABC News, Humans Dope in the Eastern.